All righty, Chris, thank you. Happening today, live pictures this morning from the state capitol in Raleigh. The House said to take a final vote to expand Medicaid across the state. The proposal would give health care to thousands in North Carolina. It's expected to head to the governor's desk. Wake Up Charlotte's Tradisha Woodard joining us now. Tradisha, it's not a done deal quite yet. Republicans are trying to use the budget as leverage here. That's right. Republican leaders dropped a caveat into the carefully negotiated measure saying even if the bill gets the governor's signature, the expansion can't be implemented until a new state budget gets approved. Today, the North Carolina House is set to give a final vote as Medicaid expansion takes another major step forward. The bipartisan bill would make 600,000 people eligible for taxpayer-funded health insurance. The idea is to boost the overall supply of health care options in the state as the number of people with health insurance increases through expansion. Supporters gave brief speeches presenting the impact the billions of dollars in federal funding expansion would provide for people who need it. Now we're taking advantage of those federal dollars uh, and we're going to be able to to uh, give so much more coverage to folks all across the state. If the bill gets the green light, it still has two more hurdles to jump through, a signature from the governor and, most importantly, pass the state's budget. And right now, the state's budget is moving along in the House with hopes of the spending plan being released next week. All righty, Tradisha, thank you. Well,